Ooh. Now my car is still nervous. <laughs> Get ready to rock and roll, I guess. Getting real. Duty 100. Let's see what she does. Still baby boost, bro. Oh, s. <laughs> Bobby, we gonna. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
booze. 5.9. 5.9 pounds of booze. Yeah. You made more torque than you did power. Yeah, but like I said, he's not taking it all the way up. Nope. That no, that's good, man. That's good. Yeah, I logged it. Now, at that RPM, we're nowhere close to turning up the turbo. Right. That's baby boost. That's baby boost. That's 5,000 RPM. Still another three to go, so. Um, you already got the log? No. I had been watching the. Okay. I had been watching the. So, yeah, we did have three. real. We had real knock. We had real knock. So, we had bad 93. Go figure, right? Oh, yeah, that's this one. Yeah, it should be about yeah, seven or eight gallons. So let's get this one right too. Okay. Right well, we tell you turn it off. Yeah, hit the button. All right, we switched fuels. We are now on E85, the good stock to push up. So now it's time to make some power. We're gonna repeat the same test. You nervous? We're gonna repeat the same test that we just did. One to one gear up to about 5K. Make sure that we have no knock. We're looking pretty, and then we're gonna start turning it up. Let's go. Let me know if he jumps up. At 5K, that like just starts to go into the power band. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna make a ton. You gotta look. This car made what? Dyno. What? 430, 440 around that. Yes. Wide open to 8200. Right. This hit that on light. We're thir wide open 30 over 5K. We're making power today, boys. Watching the boost gauge. Yeah, we're gonna send it off to uh, Rob Shoemaker, the tune maker, see what he has to say. But we're looking good. From sun up to sundown for like the last week. Really trying to perfect this build. And um, I'm, uh, I don't wanna say proud, but kind of, but we're not there yet. We still gotta make some big power. Woo! Not my car, I'm still nervous. <laughs> I got first pull to 8,000. If you're gonna go boost, that's kind of like me in the beginning. I mean, I stretched it a little bit. I played with 93 a little bit, but just decided it wasn't worth it, and it's really not. So my car lives on E85, like indefinitely, unless I need to like cross country trip or something like that, and just no boost. But you're going big power like this, E85 is the answer. 100% all day long, twice on Sunday. All right, 65 duty cycle, 11.6 uh, over boost. We're gonna try to hit 10 pounds. Still baby boost, bro. Oh, shit, Bobby, we gonna... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know what this kid's capable of doing, but when you see it for the first time, yeah, like when you see it for the first time, that's insane, insane. That's not 10 pounds. That's not even as much as my car is running now at 790, 782 to the wheels. Yeah, 734, shit. 601, Here you go, guys. at eight pounds. <laughs> Ready to rock and roll, I guess. Duty 100, getting real. See what she does. Alrighty, let's, uh, let's try this again. Yeah, yeah. All right, so she's all yours. Final numbers are in, but at 11.7,
11.7 pounds of boost and we did 800 and what, 13? 813. 813. 813. We doubled the factory wheel horsepower out of this awesome car. The cool thing too is we had our hands all over it. The dyno, the tuning, everything went down without any hiccups whatsoever. The car is solid as can be. We've got no leaks anywhere. Everything is perfect. This thing is going to be nasty on the streets. And, and here's the thing I want everyone to hear in his video. Is like, like I said, we had our hands all up in this stuff. Yeah. And, and everyone who questioned us and everything else, haters, shut your mouths. That's all I gotta say. There is still a lot of room to grow. And uh, you gotta remember that we're on pump E85 with moderate timing. That nothing crazy, nothing special. This is not a kill tune. Basically what I'm trying to say is Rob Shoemaker has tuned this car to be safe and reliable at that power level. But yeah, I'm very, very impressed with the build. It's come a long way. I'm super excited for you to get this thing back on the street and see how much fun you're going to have with it. But yeah, I couldn't be more impressed. No hiccups with install, no hiccups with tuning. No. The car held together. It didn't blow up. We were good. So if you enjoyed today's video, please like, share, subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, and I'll see you in the next video. You can cut my part out. Oh, really? I'm like. No, no, I'm going to keep it going. Yeah. Yeah, you can keep talking, man. No, no, I'd like to say earlier about all the haters. Like, I see you, and I've said this before on my channel. I think Alex gets. People out there give him a hard time is bull. Yeah. You know, I didn't come up here and have Xander 13 help me build my car. I had my friend build my car. Yeah. And no hiccups, no nothing with this car, you know? For crying out loud, man, we make internet videos here for entertainment. It don't cost you a damn thing. But yep. yet y'all kept saying, oh, y'all know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. And we, in a, in a week, built a car that doubled the horsepower safely with moderate degree timing. And we're still pulling on 11 pounds of boost, 815 and some change. Everybody's going to go out there, whoa, there's cars that make faster. Cool. Well, what people need to realize too is those cars that are making a thousand horsepower. They have built like motors. I see so, on my channel all the time, yeah. dynos are a demeasuring contest. They don't mean crap. No, it's a, they're tuning tools. They're tuning tools and that's it. Yeah. But it's but it's a good indication that when you built the car, we got it right. That's what it's oh, a good this thing is. This thing is perfect. Perfect. The, the, the short term fuel trims, everything, long term, everything is absolutely spot on. Very excited, man. This thing is, it's a beautiful car. I'm a little bit jealous. I love it. And it's a manual, so you can go out there and tear it up and have fun. Hey, you always, you always know where my address is. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're going to get the cars together, definitely. So um, he's going to be going back to Texas here soon. I'm going to go back home and spend some time with my family. I've been away from my family for about a week and a half now doing this. But yeah. Um, it's an awesome car. Awesome car. Dude, it's super happy. Super happy. So, hopefully, with the virus ending, I can actually go get a, like a shave and a haircut now. <laughs> it's been a long week. I haven't had hair this long in forever. That doesn't matter. Um, we're here for the car, and this thing performed and did exactly what it's supposed to. Didn't blow up. We're good. It really is. Well, let's put talking and go get driving. Let's do it. See you guys later.